Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming and today's video is another Forzathon guide. Uh, this week's Forzathon revolves around using the 2011 Bugatti Veyron Supersport and it is very very quick and easy Forzathon but I still make the video just in case it helps one person out then I am more than happy to do so. Um, so obviously this is a car in question, the Bugatti Veyron Supersport, costs about 2.2 million credits. Now if you're lucky you might be able to find one in the auction house for fairly cheap um, but they are quite rare. Now, if you do so happen to have one, I have created a tune for you. It's called Forza Von EVG. It's a cracking car, very, very quick. Now, I also recommend using some of your skill points uh, to buy out a load of the car's perks as you will definitely need them later on and I will explain all in a bit. Now, the first challenge wants you to earn 30 ultimate speed skills, um, which is very, very easy, actually. I know 30 seems like a daunting amount, but it's not very hard. Um, so all you have to do is go to the motorway uh, where you can just rack up very very high skills for a uh, speed for a long period of time now of course we all know what an ultimate speed skill is um, so it's where you're basically sitting at just over 210 mile an hour um, for uh, about five seconds um, and then you'll get the ultimate speed skill now all you have to do is stay at that high speed uh, for the entire run on the motorway basically um, do a couple of lengths so go down once come back uh, and back once again and you'll pretty much get those 30 ultimate speed skills it is fairly quick and fairly easy um, and it shouldn't really take too long it took me about six minutes or so if that um, now the next challenge once you get a total of 12 stars from speed traps so of course you can use the same speed trap over and over again um, and the quickest one that i feel uh, is the asmore speed sign as for three stars all you need to do is get 140 mile an hour now this is very very easy in the Bugatti Veyron to get up to 140 mile an hour takes about five or six seconds um, and as you can see here you haven't got to go too far uh, you haven't got to have a massive run up for the speed uh, the speed trap obviously three stars 140 mile an hour that means four runs of three stars uh, and it should take you no more than about one minute and 30 seconds very very quick and easy as you saw there uh, the final challenge wants you to earn four ultimate skill chains in your bugatti veyron um, now an ultimate skill chain is about 20,000 points um, multiplied by five and that counts as an ultimate skill chain i do recommend going to the motorway again um, as you can basically just fly down get a load of near miss skills and ultimate speed skills um, and then as soon as you hit about 20,000, um, you'll basically unlock the ultimate skill chain you'll see it pop up anyway um, so obviously it's fairly easy and that's also why i recommended at the beginning buying out a load of those perks with your skill points um, as they boost the amount of points you get so you'll get to an ultimate skill chain a lot quicker um, and quite easily actually which will save you a fair amount of time i'm sure a lot of people got gifted um, a fair amount of skill points a couple months back after turn 10 made a few errors um, in their ways but anyway that's what i did that's what i spent a lot of them on uh, and it helped me out a lot about five minutes just on the freeway and i managed to get about four ultimate skill chains um so this week's force thon as you've just seen is actually quite easy uh, and it shouldn't take too long i think the hardest part is probably if you haven't got a bugatti very on super sport purchasing one 2.2 million credits is a lot if you're only going to use it for one forza thon but of course that's only a decision that you can make yourself whether you want to do that um like i said i know this is a quick and easy forza thon uh, but i do enjoy making these videos i do enjoy helping people out and like i said even if it only helps out one person uh, then i am incredibly happy and glad that i've managed to do so um anyway guys i hope that you have enjoyed and i hope this has helped you out um, a massive thank you for everyone's support if you are new here it would be very very cool if you could subscribe and drop a like as well apart from that a massive thank you guys i hope you enjoyed all the best and take care